What's up, Squatty? Welcome back. So after weeks and weeks of requests and essentially uh, putting them off, we're finally gonna get to them. Tanya and Sinjin. I can already tell you this one's gonna be wild. So <laughs> buckle up. Let's get right into it. I went out to a bar, started drinking, met some girls, and you know, then I saw a cute bartender behind the bar, and he said his name was Sinjin. I'm Sinjin Documentary, all the way from Camp Space, South Africa. Awe, alles ist lecker, bra. Wow, okay. <laughs> so check this out. This girl flew to South Africa to be with some random dude. Turned out the dude was not her type of dude. Ghosted that dude. Went clubbing, found a new dude, and essentially <laughs> lived with this dude for like two months. For almost two months. Makes sense? <laughs> Probably not. Like that's not dangerous at all. Unknown territory. Random dudes. By herself. Straight wilding. Hello, Tanya. <laughs> I just like to say that I'm gonna miss you a lot. <laughs> Sinjin and I were living a long distance relationship. Hey, Tanya. <laughs> so hard. It was really hard. Yeah, I'm sure it was, buddy. <laughs> Not really. So eventually, she had to leave Ed Sheeran behind back in South Africa to continue pursuing her career of virtually inseminating her eyes into the depths of our soul. So hard. It was really hard. Like, it's pretty obvious. So she got a few loose screws in the head. Like, she's bound to pull something crazy. And Mr. Ed Sheeran himself is about to be the benefactor. Of that right. Ever been on a roller that that didn't seem too bad from from the ground? Turned out to be the worst decision of your life. Yeah, that's Tanya. Anyway, so like everybody else, she applies for the visa, gets approved. What be do? What be do? And now she's headed to the airport to uh snatch this boy up. Oh, <laughs> Yes! Fuck it up, fuck it up. I'm like, I don't even know what happened. I don't even know, I'm blacked out. I don't... Yeah, this is some next level cringe right here. You got this lady in the back all pissed off. Because our buddies over here decided to litter like half a dozen roses like it's spring in Japan. You got Miss Walmart Gabrielle Union who can't pop a bottle of champagne to save her life. <laughs> and for a minute, I, I was unaware we were in the presence of a dying hyena. And to top it off, uh, Tanya just started speaking hieroglyphics. I'm like, I don't even know what happened. I don't even know, I'm blacked out. I, don't... I am perplexed. I'm, I'm, I'm not even exactly sure how that's possible. But she did it. While looking messier than Darcy with two shots of vodka. That alone deserves a gold medal. Like, you don't understand. Right. Anyway, so fast forward a little bit, she takes him out to a New York steakhouse to discuss their dreams, goals, and <laughs> whatever. Cheers to America! <laughs> America! <laughs> when would you like to have kids? Um... Because whether I'm having kids with you or not, I'm having kids. What the hell? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that took a lefty, two rights, four loops, and two U-turns, uh, real quick. I've been telling you guys she was gonna pull something crazy. Like, who says that? So, uh, when you want a baby? Uh, I think... You know what? I'm already pregnant. What? <laughs> Knowing her, uh, Sinjin oughta better, uh, triple flush that rubber. Complimenting with a, with a couple sprays of spermicide. Psst, psst, and pulling out. <laughs> Not like Robert. I have five beautiful children. I four different... I want someone who can dream big has a drive to make, try to make those dreams happen, rather than say it's not possible. Shoot for the sky, land on the moon. That's what I'm doing. It's almost like um, you read the story and I'm just a character. You know? Ed Sheeran is spitting some Hamlet bars right now. And yes, indeed, sir, you are correct. You're a side character with no use. And I'm just a character. You know? Now, I found the scene to be <laughs> pretty hilarious because she goes into this whole condescending rant about you better have goals and you better have dreams. You better want kids or I'm gonna be mean. You get the point. All of this blah, 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 blah. For what? A shit. A shit. She lives in a shit. Oh. Bruh. He might be a little surprised walking in because I told him it was done. And it's really not. Me as a South African, I don't know what is a shed. <laughs> Welcome home. <laughs> Bruh. Oh, wow. Oh, of course. Miss Aim for the Sky land in a shed. Be ambitious. Gary V said eat doo doo and push content. 24 months of eating. Sh of course, she would be the one to, to live in a shed. That she did not even semi clean because so stressful. Really? Now the worst part about about this whole scene was 
It was not even about the stupid shed. It was her response. I wish I could say he loved it, but he definitely doesn't. To me, it's like, stuck it up. Of course, there's work to do and stuff, but I mean, that's life. I am perplexed. Woman, you is crazy. Let's take a moment and, and, and really marinate this in. This man left Earth Thang in Cape Town, Africa. Not a bad place, by the way, to go be with Tanya in a shed that was promised to be relatively ready. All of this not long after a little valedictorian spiel, which included prematurely forcing his banana to give you 2.5 kids to, to, to raise in, in, in this shed. Oh. Bruh. She even had the audacity to <laughs> do a little twirl. Oh, look at this place. Woman, you is crazy. Now, I would like to say it got better, but it got worse. He going to Costa Rica. Yeah, I'm going to Costa Rica for one month, and he has to stay out here. What? Yeah, Juna. For when? I'm going to learn herbalism. I, I want to be the community witch doctor. Oh, my God! I mean, this is not RuneScape. You don't just get up to go halfway across the world to train Herbalore. I am baffled. What is wrong with you? Ed Sheeran just got here. He just met your familia. They legit got 90 days to <laughs> figure everything out. Get murdered. The whole nine yards. And she's taking one third of that to go crush herbs and make who knows what potions. Sleep in teepees with indigenous people. <laughs> Yo, y'all taking this hippie stuff too far. Tanya leaving for 30 days in the middle of the 90 days is not at all something I really wanted. Yeah, it sucks. I'm leaving Sinjin here all by himself, but I just can't put it off for another year. Yeah, uh, that makes sense. Can't push off a little witchcraft and herbalore. I'm not exactly uh, too sure well, what kind of patient pills my man here is chugging. Maybe some enchanted meditation, voodoo magic, Wingardium Leviosa, maybe, whatever it is. But he is oblivious to all this uh, <laughs> endangerment. And Tanya here takes not a responsibility. Oh, the shed is infested with trash? Welcome to America, honey. Oh, I'm leaving to Costa Rica for 99 Herbalore? Welcome to America, honey. And now she's ditching him with her mom to do... I don't, I don't know what he's gonna be doing. What else are you gonna do? Wake up, you don't have a job, Tanya's not here, so you just say, hey, mom, what, are we, what did you want to done today? While she's gone, you can help out with mowing, weed whacking, we'll be power washing, the back patio. Okay. So yeah, this whole circus turned into some big excuse for the mom to obtain a free maid <laughs> for the next month. And she openly admits it. I will like just, you know, encourage him, keep him occupied to get my stuff done. <laughs> ha ha. Now luckily Tanya left a guy like Sinjin and <laughs> not a guy like Robert. She might have just messed around, come back and found a dozen <laughs> kids in the shed. <laughs> not even joking. I'm not even joking. <laughs> You want kids? So the mom got this man out here working like a wild hog her day. And then he speck a chance he gets to like uh savor the moment. She uh she makes sure he doesn't. Hey Singe, that's my cake. Well you want a piece? Okay. Yeah, it's my tiramisu. Mm. If I'm not here, don't touch my Jack Daniels. <laughs> don't assume, don't take it upon yourself. Things are going okay. It's not that's yeah, it's not the base. My tiramisu, ma'am, it's not that serious. Look, he probably should have asked, but if I'm Sinjin, <laughs> let's be real. I think I'm gonna need more than a couple glasses of Jack Daniels to keep me from boxing myself up and shipping myself back to Cape Town, Africa. I'm just saying, you know, I'm just saying. Her being stingy only reconfirms to me why there's a DVD player masquerading as a cabinet in the kitchen. <laughs> Crackhead vibes. learning herbal remedies and connecting more with mother nature. When you go home, you say, I learned to dance salsa with a black guy. In <laughs> a good looking black guy in yeah. Costa Rica. Crushing herbs and uh, connecting with the mother nature, eh? Looks to me like there's a bit more stuff connecting, if you know what I mean. Could you imagine being Ed Sheeran back at home watching this episode? I am disgusted with the shape of Yo. Speaking of which, while she was out here banana chasing, buddy back home was taking uh, massive elves. It's been kind of tough getting hold of Tanya while she's been over in Costa Rica. See, at this point, it should have been adios amigo, pointing to his luggage, get in the chopper. But no, he continues taking and gulping in elves while she's gulping down tequila and uh, who knows what else. And it just so happened she's rocking and rolling with the same dude. Oh! It hurts. Like, I just want to go out with the girls, feel the beat, and just go through me and. Just enjoy the night. I love to flirt. I love to talk with other guys that I think are cute. Hey. Costa Rica, we having a nice time, bro. 
Yo, she really got this man out here looking stupid. You ever get finessed so hard you, you can't help but smile? Tears, brother, tears. The one time she actually picks up and this is the first thing you see. That's it, man. That's it. Bury me inside a Gucci slipper. Your boy going six feet under. Yeah, can I can do it, please tell you've been drinking some. Can you hear it in my voice? Um, bruh. Listen, <laughs> you can help me by just telling me you're home that I don't have to be on my self. Good thing with Good phones night. is I can schedule messages. Oh my god! What is wrong with you? See, she's having a little too much fun. Rumor has it, she might be a little prego. Hey. If the baby comes out looking like Bob Marley, you ain't know some sum went down in the streets of Costa Rica. Costa Rica, we having a nice time, bro. Yo, yo, what the? Send you this time, baby. Hit me up and I'll book you uh two first class tickets back to Cape Town. One for you and the other one for <laughs> that bottle of Mama Jack Daniels. Ch -ch Get in the chopper. But hey, what do I know? I'm just sipping so. <laughs> We don't, I don't know how you could have been for all I know you could have been my best friend you could have been my brother like I don't know if our souls are like meant to be tears brother tears